doing guys welcome back to another episode of slime quest tv we're out doing some musky fishing sun just came up it got a little cool overnight i feel have a feeling these fish might have pushed up in the weeds uh these muskies should have just got off spawn or should be finishing up there might be some still going through the motions but for the most part they're done spawning we're targeting shallow looking for some nice fish stick with us let's get some in the bag zero action, I start to begin to lose hope. The only thing keeping me focused is a moonset before a series of dangerous storm fronts heading right my way. I continue to pound the only few weeds I could find. It's now or never. guys it's a good one you gotta stick it out Alright guys, one in the bag, storm's about to hit, we gotta get after it real quick. All right, guys, another one in the bag. I had to turn the cameras off there. We've got a rainstorm coming here. I already came, actually, but got yeah, another one in the bag. Not nearly as much as the, or as big as the last one, but good stuff, man. Getting fish here. I'm going to put the camera down to take them out of the net. All right, guys, another fish. Getting after it. This rain's going to stop here soon. Stick with us. because the rain but it's about to stop now we just got another one in the bag uh, this this thunderstorm just it turned them on i'm gonna pull this one out of the bag if you guys see it. there we go guys just a little whippersnapper but that's what it's all about right there guys Go 
there was another one in the bag. Holy cow, guys, what a storm that was. I just got the boat back on the trail. We're all cleaned up, getting ready to head home. But I want to talk to you guys about a little bit what I was doing. Now, the water temperature was 60 degrees. It was actually 59 when I first got here. Some fish are probably spawning. Some even haven't spawned yet. Some are already spawned out. And uh, I was looking for first emergent weeds. It happened to be milfoil in this lake. There was a ton of milfoil up in six seven foot and they were about two foot tall stalks so i was running right over right on the edge of those right over the top of the short stalks the deepest stalks and uh i was running bnn custom tackle and rod, rods and tackle baits uh the slasher produced the big fish the jointed slasher um it's a six and a half inch bait big fat female took that bait and uh it choked it too had to do a little surgery, revived him. He's, he swam off just fine. The other two came on a talons, ripping shad. And uh, and I didn't have much line out, guys. I was just trolling over six, seven foot of water. I only had about 15, 20 foot of line out. And just, uh, and I was going, you know, I started off a little bit fast, about four mile an hour. And what happened was the wind picked up and I started going a little bit slower, just riding, riding the wind pretty good. And that's when I started getting fish. And I was doing about 3.4 mile per hour. I slowed down from about 3.7 to 3.4, and I started getting fish that way. So, great day in the water, guys. Went three for four. We had one rip that just came off, and it was raining. Sorry we didn't get all that on footage, guys. That rain was just brutal. I mean, it just stopped. It rained for literally four hours. It rained for three or four hours. So, thanks for sticking with us, guys. We'll see you next time on Slime Quest TV.